Oh, so you keep calling a woman a BT one thousand you've what never seen or heard anything what about. She? What is she? You tell me. Tell your story. Let you tell your story. What is no, no, no. It, I, I would have told my story if she was a BT one thousand. I would have told people that this person was a bad person, wouldn't I? And this tell bad person would have been on the internet talking shit about me. You've already hey, said bro. that it's happened to you. No, you got on the gag order. Come on now, stop lying. I don't. Time. How? Who I got on the gag order? Seriously, the little woman you had the baby with. How, what, you, you're, you are a way richer man than I've ever been. Can you put a gag order on a woman? Because you weren't able to do it. I have gag orders on two women. No, those women spoke. You have Ooh. literally articles where they were saying they wanted their money. It's online. Who? Would you like for me to show it to the audience right now if you put me on screen? No. I'm not going to do it to disrespect that. you, no, but they can Google you. it. No, I'm asking you who. Okay, hold on a minute. I'll pull it up. No, I'm, I'm not asking you to pull no, it up. You no, I, you don't have to ask me who. I'll show it. I'm not I will you show, show it. Name. You can say the name. and I, You talking about Jocelyn? Uh, sir, you know who it is. Okay, so my daughter was 15 years old in that case, correct? It was a case, yes. So my daughter was 15 years old in that case, correct? It was a case, yes. You answer my question, I'll answer your question. I don't know how my old your daughter was. Years. It's public records. You want you to would show know. it. Go look at, so go look at the records before you show it. I'll let you show this. Go look at the records. Go look at the ages since you know everything. Why would she say you didn't take care of your kids? Why okay. would she say yeah, we're it? We're going to get to it. Go look at the ages. You say you're smart, right? And brother, I'm going to let you up in a minute. Let me milk this milk blood ass nigga. Because he want to talk about public records. but we gonna I'm not talking about public record. I asked you a question. You record, told bro. me. Talking, I even said. You want to show public records, right? Her, this person's name is Jocelyn Vaughn. Okay, please don't say her last name on my platform. I don't okay, I thought you said I was supposed to say it. See, I only I, said, I didn't want to say her name at all. Sir, sir, I said her name. I gave you a first name. You gave the last name. You're I'm to be reading what it says. It says sued him in September sir, to establish... Sir. Okay, if you're not going to listen, all I want is the ages, you disrespectful little bitch. See, what was I haven't called you anything, name? and it doesn't say it doesn't say their ages. It does not say daughter? their ages. What it says okay, is... Okay, so th therefore you should be quiet right now. My daughter was 15 years old. And so when you decide to leave a woman and leave her alone, she has a right to take out child support, does she not? Yeah, well, you, she, you don't have to... If you don't leave, she can do it while you're still with her. Well, I wasn't with her. I left her in 2015. No, I'm saying... That's I just told you what the law was, that she can do it okay, if you're still right. with her. That's correct. that's correct. I left her in 2015. But I had the child with her in 2002. You mean to tell me the entire time she never thought about putting a case on me until I left? Why so, do you think that happened? No, I'm asking you then by that same logic. Why hasn't mm -hmm. this woman I had a kid with three years ago did it to me? That don't have nothing to do with whether you sent me a picture or not, sir. No, it has something to do with you saying I have a child. I'm not. I'm not. Sir, sir, claiming. sir. I have a kid. I have a kid with a You're woman. You're saying I have a not, child. Listen, I'm, I'm not answering, claiming. I'm answering it. I'm answering it. You do. I have a kid with a woman that she wants nothing to do with online. She's not talking about me online. I pay my child support and she don't say nothing. That could be your arrangement. No, she and talked you about did. you in court. You're talking about one woman, sir. I yes. have multiple children. Okay, that's one woman. I just said I have kids by another woman that does not talk about, and you have multiple kids by different women yourself. So why do we you both have, have multiple kids about. by multiple women sir, and never been married? Talking, why do sir? we have that? You got to stop doing that. Let me finish what I'm saying, and then you can go ahead. From the internet. I was so ashamed. So are you admitting you sent me a picture now? You sent me a picture. Not of yes, a I sent you a picture of a baby. No, of no, a no, no, he's lying, y'all. I never said he sent me the picture of the baby mama. I, the I sent you a picture of the baby. first was of oh, the baby. God. Whatever you want me to say, I'm chest. saying it. I want to know what the next step is. Of his baby laying across his chest. And it's a young, light-skinned girl. I think she's like brown skin. Everybody's light to me. I'm dark as fuck. So everybody, she's like a brown skin girl. So she's not too light. But for me, she's like, I'm blacker than a motherfucker. But he has a baby by this said young lady, which he saw a picture of. So I no, sent a no, picture of my girl, girl, too? No, this, was, this probably was a thought. I can't confirm if that was the baby mama or not. So I don't want to speak out of turn. I don't want to lie. But he definitely sent a picture of the baby laying across his chest. And underneath the caption, he said the pounds and the ounces of this baby. And he's flat out lying. And he know he lying. 
No, I sent you a picture of my baby and I sent you a picture of the mom and she's a thought. Go ahead. You can try to say it condescending all you want. I'm not saying that's not you may you may be I confusing English words. Time, maybe you, you don't know what to, English try, words mean, but I was know, not being maybe condescending. You don't know what bullshit mean, and that's what you but I was bullshit. not being condescending. Maybe you don't it's know like what English words street, mean, but I wasn't being about condescending. This woman off the balcony and look at this woman right now. She looked like she's ready to go for a round. I ain't said nothing about you, hell, nobody off the balcony. That's y'all that's y'all doing that. I ain't I'm had to lie on like, you. I'm asking you from your professional. I opinion, haven't had to lie like, on you. So don't try to bring me again? into y'all's lie. Well, I haven't done it. Do it look like she ready to get hung again? Sir, have I hung, spoke about like this? Sir, have I said yes. one word about this? Yes, you was on the panel when this shit was being said. I said, have I said anything about it? Yes. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. What did I say? You was laughing all with it. You was like, oh, this man you, said you were laughing at what they said. Now you I said something because I laughed at them. Me. You interrupted on one word. I was I didn't land my plane. But what did I say? Because you're trying to show out for your audience. So I'll let you. I'm asking you what I said and you won't answer it. Why you never you answer me? direct questions. So, sir, how can you create a fatherless America so you understand the importance of having a kid out of wedlock? But then you go out and create a kid out of wedlock. Don't you think that's hypocritical, brother? Sure, I'll answer that question. First off, have you seen the movie A Fatherless America? I sure did. And what was in the movie? Since you said you said it, you can let them know if I talked about what you just said was hypocritical. Yes, you're very hypocritical because... No, no, no. The was my movie... You brought up the movie and said it's hypocritical. What was you my movie about? Tell them. No, I'm saying you are hypocritical. No, that's tell them. You brought up my movie, sir. You said, how can I make this movie and do X, Y, Z? What was the movie about? It's in the title, genius. The, that, that lets y'all know he didn't see it, so I'll tell y'all what it was about. I actually those, did see it. So if you saw it, you know you're lying. My movie was about laws. My movie was about the laws. That's and not all it's about. Yes, it, my movie was about the laws, and then I had people... Did, let me ask you this. Let me ask he you this. won't let me. Why? Now he now he brought up the movie, and I was going to tell y'all what the movie's about, and why? he won't let I'm me not, say what it was about. I'm not about, I'm not Convenient. About Every I'm time about I speak a truth, he let's cuts me off. Every time. I didn't cuss him out, didn't call him a name. I was going to tell him what my own movie was about your that everybody who saw it knows. He won't let me say it. Bro, your, your supporter is confused as well. He just came up here and said, Tommy is the first guy that came to YouTube and expressed the importance of fathers. That ain't what he said. He said was That's talking exactly about what, what was said. that is not what he said. And he can come wow. back up here and say it. Everybody heard it. He did not say That's I was the first man to come up here and talk about fathers. That is not what he said. He said I was the That's first not what man. I just said. I said the importance of fathers in the home. That is That's not what he said. said. That guy so said I was the first man to come up here and talk about what was ailing the black community like that. That's what he said. What? Let him come back up here. Oh, my goodness. Let him come back. I don't want to misquote him. Let him come back. So, sir, sir, let me ask you this. A part of a fatherless America was the importance of having fathers in the home and the fact that the laws. So I said nothing about being married. So I said nothing about being married. I'm not talking about being married. I never so said that. So how do you house. know? How do you I know? Because I'm not putting it on the internet that I'm not in my child's life. Tell him. Why won't you let me Tell him how you know. Why won't you let me finish? Mm -hmm. You just talked about finishing. Go ahead. I'm saying a part of your movie was expressing the law and it was showing how the law helps take fathers out of the home and make them obsolete. So knowing the importance of the law and the importance of fathers being in the home, why would you go out and create a single father situation or a single parent home situation yourself in your 40s, sir? Because if I know I'm not dealing with the law, that the law does not apply to me and the person I'm with, mm -hmm. which is why you wouldn't be seeing any problems with me and the law and the person. Because if it so, was, if I said that somebody was having a problem with their girl, you'd see it. But I can't assume that someone's having a problem with their girl just because I don't like them. I would never do that. I would never assume that you are currently having a problem with the girl you're dealing with. 
That would be just me being an asshole. So no one sees is, it, but I'm saying it. So what you're saying is it's okay to have a baby outside of wedlock as long as she don't give you a problem? Hold on. I've been saying that I don't even believe in the social construct of marriage. Anybody mm -hmm. that watches me says that, knows that. So are you admitting that you just had another little bastard kid? Because it considered that you're not married, it's a bastard, correct? I just told you. You said, and I said, mm-hmm. I'm not talking about sure what did. I said. I'm no, no, I'm agreeing happened. with you. Yes, sir. And now no, I, what I would need y'all to do no. was show no, how that child's me. life is being you. fucked up by I'm either my life or the mom is a piece bastard. of shit. No, I'm agreeing with you. But then the next question is, when you just stated that I had a man go over to my mom's church, that's what you said. Then why the fuck would I then invite the Internet into more of my shit? Same thing you said. You said that's my business about your own thing. You said that. I remember when people were questioning you and you said that's your business. Now you're telling me. That if the internet knows something about me, I should tell them. Or if they don't know and they ain't questioning, I should still tell them. For what reason? What reason? If I got herpes yesterday, why would I come to the internet and tell them today? What reason would that help? I don't know what just happened but he's not saying nothing but the whole logic is these just like how y'all kept telling that last guy and i get I that all the people on his like the that, hold on brother I don't oh, i'm sorry StreamYard. you got cut off i couldn't hear you so i was just trying to run the show until you came I back i don't think stream yards like the fact that i'm showing your face on youtube so i'm gonna have to cover this thing up see because they keep kicking me out you know you banned from youtube so they don't want you on youtube so i think it flags people's channels when they no have it doesn't i seem to do pretty well when i'm on other people's channel yeah, but I'm not those other people. I'm Kwame Brown, so they tend to hold you me said, at a You said you said people. You did just say this. Or do y'all not even listen to y'all self? Y'all just spend did your you whole time trying to be sarcastic. Did you just hear what I said? I you, said I said people. I did not disagree, but I said they hold me to a different standard. Do you? Then not why did you that? even bring up people? Because I did, but they hold me to a different standard. <laughs> then why did you bring up people? I see why you can only fuck thoughts, but let's get back to the conversation. Why do you um, worry about who I fuck? This is weird. Because, because it's easy if you let me explain. How do you know who I fuck? Name one person you know I fuck. Name one. Are, Since are you, you say I only fuck thought, name one. Are you just gonna keep talking, or are you gonna be? Are we having a conversation? No, I'm waiting on you to name one person I fuck since you call him a thought. Well, it sounds like you're just showing out for your audience because you're oh not trying God. to have a conversation. Yeah, this are you is asking strange. me questions and then you keep talking? So let me answer one of the questions. You got to calm down to do so. I know you're a little drunk, but let me answer. Now so I'm if you're a man, drunk. if you're a man talking about fatherless America and the importance of fathers in the household, one would think that you would not be so irresponsible to just go out and create babies. Therefore, you have to give up some money and a check, regardless of whether you have to I deal don't with it give up its money or a check at all. So you don't so, so you don't pay for your child. to Listen live? to what you just said. You should be able to look this up. It's easy. You know this. It's so not, what, I'm not talking about a court case, dude. I'm talking about regardless of the fact if you a man. If you have a child, give you give up money. money. Wouldn't you? Yes. I have a 17-year-old that's about to turn 18 next month. So you don't have a little baby boy? Yes, I have a baby boy. Okay, so you're not, you're not taking care of that baby boy? regardless. I of just stated to you, I have a 17-year-old right now who uh -huh. goes to a private school and who just got a brand new car and she got that from me to say, okay. I also pay for this house. You've seen how big it is. I pay for the other one. Also, also off of Camp Creek, two of them. What's the other one? What does that have to do with your? No, son? you're saying pay for, I pay for yes. Cadillac cars and Cadillac trucks. I pay for children. internet. I pay for Some everything. Now you got people saying who cares, but y'all are asking me about my personal life. But we're talking about your children. Yes, because it I pay for hypocrite. everything. Listen, that's not that doesn't make any sense. I'm speaking specifically. Michael to the Jordan point. had kids in his fifties. You told me niggas too old. Talking. Let me remove you for a second. You can't seem to calm down and have a conversation. I'm not going to hear you do all this word salad and project projecting like you do. I'm asking you 
about a man who is creating movies, who is talking about black women, holding them to task about every mistake that they make. And you're in your 40s having children and not trying to see that as a mistake. You're unmarried. You have to pay something for a kid that you have. Regardless of whether it's through the courts or not, you're going to have to make an arrangement to pay this woman something. So why, as a businessman, as a black man, you are, to me, you losing. To still have babies that you're entitled to pay for 18 years in your 40s? I don't pay anything. I don't pay Outside anything. Outside of wedlock, when you're I not pushing nothing. towards something, you're losing. Sir, I pay nothing. So you, you keep don't pay saying I your, pay. You don't pay nothing you, for your son. Y'all, this is the loadedest, stupidest shit. So you shit. pay nothing for your son. Listen to what you're saying. I have to pay a woman. If I take don't care of a child pay? I have, how is that a bad thing? Because rather, if you take care of the child, that means you have to buy diapers, right? So you have to pay the diaper company, correct? For the child, yes. So it's going to cost you money for this child. That's what we're talking about. Yes, that so and it costs your, me money for my lights now. Your, Everything 40s, I do, it costs me money your, for. That's, that's, that's not the same thing, bro. How your are you trying life. to tell me that I'm wrong for paying this? Tammy, if you don't want to have a conversation, I'm about to throw you off. Please do, because you're just saying so things. Be quiet for 90 seconds. Be quiet for 90 seconds. You're on my panel. You're trying to do two things at one time. You're trying to host your show and talk to me, and you're being disrespectful. I'm literally answering what you say. I don't need. I don't need to talk to you. You know that, right? Okay. So I'm asking you, can you drop to me. Be quiet. I'm not disrespecting you. I ain't called you. So I told you. I'm name asking once. you to be quiet. Then give me 90 seconds. Thank you. So the point that I'm making, and any man knows this. This is a grown man still making babies into his 40s. It's not free to have a baby. I don't care whether you're using this semantics of I'm not paying the woman, I'm paying for the child. You're in your 40s creating babies by the same women that you say disrupt the community by having kids out of wedlock. We can look up the numbers of real educated people like Larry Elder and Thomas Sowell and Barack Obama and what they state about having kids outside of wedlock and how you're basically putting them at a deficit to do so. But now you're trying to clean it up by saying, oh, because I don't have to pay and go to the state and they're not talking about me, I didn't make a bad decision. And on Moonlight's panel, you flat out lied. And you won't come up here and give a real man's response and say, if you sent me a picture of a kid or not. On Moonlight's panel, you said you didn't. On this panel, you're trying to be facetious and go, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. You're a fucking idiot. You're a fucking idiot. You won't admit nothing that you say. You had a kid. You're in your 40s. You're a fucking idiot. There's no way to slice it and dice it. If some kid is following you, they are a fucking idiot. You punch women. You get fought by. You get in a fight with women on Fresh and Fit. You're about to fight women on the side of the road. You're an out of control little small man. And now you can go. He just said, give him 90 seconds for him to ask me something. He asked me nothing. He said loaded things. I didn't say I was going to ask you okay, anything. Then, okay, I said, give me 90 seconds. Then he said he'd let me talk. Get the fuck off I, my I, I, I was oh, quiet to do so proper, he could talk, to then tried to respond, the and then he I dropped me down. I didn't say I was going to ask you shit. He I dropped said, me down. Y'all, he that said all that shit, then he dropped.